Just like everything else, we're going to find it in Add over here, Navigation, and then Menu. We have a few different options as well for this. You can have a horizontal menu going across the top or bottom of your site, and you can also look at the options that they have for vertical. I'm going to stick with horizontal, and I'm just going to pick one that grabs my attention here. All of these navigation menus are going to have animation built into them, so they'll have an effect when you roll over your mouse, as you can see in this one. And it already has built in all of the pages that I just made. So where to place this? If I roll this around on my site, if I put it here in the center, it turns yellow as a warning that you are dropping this in one of your uh, main pages. I do not want it on a main page, I want it on the master. That was that one at the very top that we named portfolio. Anything that is on a master page, just like my design and background, will be there stuck throughout the whole website. So I want these buttons to always be on top. So I'm just stretching these out so they kind of cover the whole top of my site. And they're on my master. So inside those pages, we still have a couple things to link to. For example, in About Me, you have six different pieces of work you're going to show. So we're going to use page groups on each of our main pages to have links inside. Starting with family, I'm going to come right over here to add and we see page parts and they're called page groups. I'm going to click on that, click on page group again and another window is going to load which is going to go inside the family page and it says here add pages to your website so I'm going to place this drop it inside the family page so it turns yellow and I'm going to kind of extend the box so it does take up most of the family page but I want to leave over here I want to leave it blank so I have room for a navigation menu which is what we're going to do next so I'm just going to play with this just a little bit more, pull this down, and then here's the space for my navigation menu. Over here, if I look at my page manager, I now see, again, portfolio, and underneath my master page, I see family, and then page one, two, and three. Now what goes under family? One is the family tree or shield, and the other one is meet my family. So I'm going to label these right now. Page one, I'm just going to put family tree. Page two, I just double click, meet them. I don't need a page three. So I'm going to select this, drop down menu, press delete, press OK, and now I have family organized into family tree and meet them. Now, I want to have links on the family page. So if I'm on the meet them page, I can go to the family tree page and vice versa. So what I'm going to do is down here for page group, it gives me all of the options I have to edit this page group, which are these two mini pages. So I'm going to put add menu. I'm going to have this be vertical so it fits in the corner of the page and I'm going to pick this arrow one here and it's over here in the corner. If I put it over here on the side it's going to be on the master page. If I put it here in the middle it'll only show up on the family tree page and I need this to be on the family main page so that means it should go in this outer one right here that means if I'm on the family tree page I will see the mini menu or if I'm on the meet them page I'll see the menu so it already 
set up automatically the two links that it knows are in my page group. But let's say I want to change the color of this. I want it to kind of match the rest of my site. I'm going to click to edit. And you can change the skin, which would be the menu type, but I'm going to change color right here. I'm going to change the arrows to this dark pink and just leave it like that. I can resize this as well, taller and closer together. So there, I now have a couple layers of pages. I have a master page, which is the background. I have a main page of the family that has the links that will be there as long as I'm in the family section. And then in this smaller box is where I'll put the two mini pages under family, which are family tree and meet them. This paragraph here of instructions can just be deleted and then you're ready to get started. I'm going to go through one more setting up of a page group with you and I'm sure you can do the rest on your own. We are going to do the About Me page together because it has six uh, mini pages underneath it. So let's do that one together. I'm going to navigate to it over here in my page manager or you can just click on the link above and we're taken to the About Me page. So to add a page group, again I go to Add, Page Parts, Page Group and it sets up three by default, but I need six. So first I'm going to move this over so it's inside the About Me page. I'm going to pull it down again so it takes up most of the space. I'm leaving this over here for a six-part navigation menu. And over here in page group, I can add the number of pages I need. So right now under About Me, it just says one, two, and three. But I need three more. So I'm going to add another page, leave it blank, add another page, and do that until you have six. Okay, so let's name our mini pages. Page one underneath About Me is where I'm from which is going to be a poem. Your second underneath that is your autobiography. The third mini page under About Me is going to be the collage. Then your resume. And the last two is photo essay. And the other is greatest accomplishment, which is kind of long. I'm just going to put accomplishment there. And now I have those six mini pages set up. I'm going to do the same thing again and place a mini navigation menu for these six pages underneath About Me. In order to do that, make sure you are clicked on your first mini page. So in this case, you should be clicked on where I'm from. That should be selected. And then in the menu page group, you can add menu. I'm going to click the same vertical arrow menu. And you can see over here, again, if I put it over here, it's on the master. If I put it inside, it'll only be on where I'm from. So I need it out here between both of them. Now, you need to go through the rest of your main pages, friends, school, writing, future, faves, and look at the guide to see what you need to put under each one. You're going to need page group for each of your main sites. Put in a navigation menu and remember to leave a spot here. So you should have a couple layers. Your master page, your main page, inside of that is a page group, but on the main page is where your navigation 
menu needs to be 